Hello, and welcome to Everything in Cosmos. Hope you're having a wonderful day. In this video, we will discuss we'll look into why women tend to earn less than men and its consequences, and discuss potential solutions that might address this problem. Why women earn less. One major reason women make less than men is due to the gender pay gap, according to research released by the World Economic Forum. Global female earnings only account for 63% of what male earnings do globally. The gender pay gap can be explained by various factors, including occupational segregation, discrimination, and the motherhood penalty. Occupational segregation refers to women being overrepresented in lower-paying jobs while being underrepresented in those offering more money, an effect known as occupational segregation. Discrimination refers to workplace bias and prejudice against women that leads to lower pay and limited opportunities. Motherhood penalty refers to any negative repercussions caused by having children, including reduced opportunities for promotion or lower salaries. Implications of Gender Wealth Gap The gender wealth gap has far-reaching ramifications. Women are at increased risk of living in poverty than their male counterparts in old age. Financial instability affects more women. They lack access to credit and investment opportunities than male investors do, further damaging economic development efforts and slowing progress overall. Furthermore, it hinders female contributions that would contribute positively to economic development by restricting them in contributing towards economic expansion. Solution to address gender wealth gaps In order to effectively close the gender wealth gap requires taking multiple approaches promoting pay transparency, enforcing equal pay laws, and decreasing motherhood penalties is just one way. Also increasing female representation in higher paying jobs while supporting diversity leadership positions helps address occupational segregation issues and address occupational segregation. Financial education coupled with increasing access to credit or investment options is another great way of closing wealth gaps. Government policies providing tax incentives for companies which promote gender diversity can also prove helpful in closing this gender wealth gap. Examples of success There have been significant efforts made to close the gender wealth gap. For example, Australia implemented policies such as mandatory reporting of gender pay gaps and expanded parental leave for fathers that have helped narrow it. Rwanda implemented policies designed to empower women economically by increasing access to credit and entrepreneurial opportunities. Their efforts led to an impressive rise in women-owned businesses. Gender wealth gaps remain an urgent problem that requires multifaceted strategies to solve. Issues including pay gaps, occupational segregation, and motherhood penalties all play a part in creating this imbalance. To combat them, policies and programs must promote gender equality to combat this disparity effectively. Examples of successful efforts to combat the gender wealth gap show progress is possible and efforts must continue towards gender parity to give women equal economic opportunities as men. Thank you for hanging out with us. If you like this video, please give us a like and subscribe to Everything in Cosmos. No pressure if don't want to. But feel free to check out our other videos on finance, stocks, and crypto. Till we meet again, have a wonderful day.